It has now been set for a lawsuit filed against Florida for dropping its daily COVID-19 report. State lawmaker Carlos Guillermo Smith submitted a public record records request three weeks ago for case information for Orange County. He spoke with West Chew's Gail Pasco Brown tonight. That's right. State Representative Carlos Guillermo Smith wants answers about COVID-19 data and is suing the Florida Department of Health to get it. How many children are currently hospitalized in Orange County with COVID-19? The state won't tell you. Smith wants the daily COVID-19 dashboard to resume, the same one that was up for about a year. Judge John Cooper of Leon County is presiding in this case. I'm going to grant the motion for uh, intervention. Well, today was another bad day for the DeSantis administration in court. Judge Cooper overruled their objection and allowed major news organizations to intervene in support of our lawsuit for COVID-19 data in Florida. The attorney for the Department of Health argued the information is confidential. It's all confidential and exempt information uh, unless the department um, determines that it's not. Why is it a secret now? And by the way, if it's confidential now, as they claim, was it confidential before when it was on the dashboard every day for almost a year? Wow. It doesn't make sense. And a lot of the case law says public records delayed or public records denied. And that's kind of what we're looking at here. And Judge Cooper set the two day trial for next week, September 29th and 30th. What they're doing is a huge disservice to Floridians who need access to real-time COVID-19 information so that they can make informed decisions on how to best protect themselves and their families. I'm Gail Pascal brown in Orange County for West. <laughs>